drones on a medical mission. Across the lush rice paddies of the Tanzanian archipelago of Zanzibar, they're spraying the non-toxic solution Aquitaine over fields to keep mosquitoes from reproducing. These large expanses of stagnant water are breeding grounds for the malaria-carrying insects. So once we control them here, we will see far fewer mosquitoes making it to the houses where people live, biting these people and therefore transmitting malarial disease. So by controlling them right at the source, we hope to have an impact ultimately on the transmission of malaria. According to the World Health Organization, more than 430,000 people, most of them children, die of malaria each year. Sub-Saharan Africa accounts for 90% of those deaths. And in Tanzania, 70,000 people die annually from the mosquito-transmitted disease. Local officials in Zanzibar hope using drones will help bring down those numbers and eradicate malaria here by 2023. As you can see, the way the paddies look like, it's very difficult to just walk through the paddies and apply the chemical. So you want to have something that can just spray it on the water surface, it spreads, does its job, and that is it. Once sprayed on the water's surface, Aquitaine quickly kills larvae. Using a drone covers a large area in a short span of time, and it's much cheaper than using a helicopter. Scientists have taken samples from before, during, and after spraying to determine the full impact of the approach. They ultimately plan to roll out the method across Africa, where they hope to eliminate malaria one country at a time. Natasha Hussein, TRT World.